Welcome to Ocolab YouTube channel. Today we'll be talking about the features of Ocolab stage top incubation systems for time lapse microscopy. In this presentation, we'll briefly review time lapse microscopy, the components of stage top incubators, and we will then focus on the differences between our bold line fully digital incubators and Uno THCO2 with a manual gas mixer. What is time-lapse microscopy? You're trying to image cells on more than one point in time. From a few hours to a few days, the challenge is how to keep the cells alive while on the microscope. You have to control temperature, gas concentration, and humidity. This slide shows you two types of Ocolab stage top systems. On the left are bold line fully digital incubator with touchscreen interface and on the right, the more affordable Uno TH CO2 with digital temperature control and a manual gas mixer. Let's see them in more detail. All Ocolab stage top chambers are compatible with both types of controllers here on the left, bold line and Uno TH CO2. The stage top chamber provides both heating and gas conditioning. Our easy to remove chambers have a fast thermal response. Remember to use an objective heater if you're imaging with oil immersion objectives. This slide shows the bold line fully digital stage top system. Let's see it in more detail. In the image on the right hand side, you can see a stack of controllers. They're digital for temperature and gas. Each stack requires one touchscreen interface. For now, disregard the small red box, it's an optional. Humidity is controlled in active way. It involves a bottle with humidity sensor lid and a heated base. Because of this design, the microenvironmental chamber does not have an open moat with water. We design it this way for safety reasons to avoid spilling water in the nose piece. To illustrate the microenvironmental chambers, I will use a K-frame for inverted microscopes. A K-frame simply fits a microscope stage with an opening 160 by 110 mm. This is just an example, as chambers for all stage brands and models, including upright, are available. Ocolab K-frame chambers have built-in perfusion holes. They come plugged with small screws. You can unplug them if you need to do perfusion. The lid slides open, and you do not have to put water inside the chamber to provide humidity. Hence, there is no moat and no water. Several optional lids are available for the K-frame chamber. A colder lid allowing you to focus the condenser, an injection lid for the insertion of capillaries, or a laser interlock lid for laser safety. A sample is placed inside the microenvironmental chamber using an insert. This slide shows you a partial list. Please focus on the inserts in the red box. These are meant for multi-well plates. A stage top incubator will require a perforated metal plate to improve thermal uniformity on the bottom surface. However, if you're using an oil immersion objective, the insert for multi-well plates will be an open frame, as shown in the blue box. This will allow the objective to move freely between wells. If you're using an oil immersion objective, you have to use an objective heater, here in the image on the right. The objective heater is represented by a heating band, here in yellow, secured around the objective in this example by a green strap. An oil immersion objective will touch the bottom of the well through the oil and will draw heat away from your sample. This is why an objective heater is required with oil immersion objectives. Digital gas controllers are integrated through cable-less connections, Simply stack the controllers on top of each other and the connection is established. A single touchscreen interface is used for a stack of controllers. The digital display shows data about gas concentration and flow. Drivers for the most common microscope software are available. Humidity control is active. The humidity module includes a heated base with temperature sensor. Fill the bottle with water and insert it in the heated base. Gas of desired composition will flow through, get heated and humidified. The percentage of humidity is read by the heated humidity sensor lid. 
Humidified gas is carried to the microenvironmental chamber through a heated and insulated tubing, avoiding condensation. With this system, you can select the percentage of humidity you want to deliver to the sample in the range 51 to 95%, with a sensor resolution of 1%. You can see all parameters on the touchscreen display. There are multiple sensors. One monitors room temperature, others control the temperature of the staged up chamber lid and base, sample if you're operating in sample feedback mode, and objective heater if you're using one. In sample feedback mode, simply place the provided thermocouple in a reference well. This will ensure accuracy of 0.1 Celsius from the set point, regardless of room temperature fluctuations. The same display shows you relative humidity, in this example 95%, gas concentration of the individual gases, as well as gas flow rate of individual gases and total gas flow. An alternative, more affordable staged up incubation system is UNO THCO2. That stands for UNO Temperature Humidity CO2. It includes a temperature controller with touchscreen interface a manual gas mixer, a humidity module, and an air pump. It is compatible with all Ocolab stage top chambers and was designed with a more conservative budget in mind without compromising performance. Uno THCO2 includes a temperature controller with a 4.3 inch touchscreen interface. This intuitive user-friendly interface has onboard memory to log data and a mini USB port to download it to a memory card. Uno THCO2 includes a dual gas mixer accepting CO2 and background air. This is a manual mixer with a 1% accuracy. An air pump is also included. Uno THCO2 includes a humidity module. This has a heated base, a glass bottle with lid, and a heated and insulated tubing. To operate the humidity module, simply enable it by checking the box and input room temperature. The system will automatically set the temperature of the heating base and heated tube, optimizing humidity performance. Let's see a more detailed comparison between UNO THCO2 and Boldline Fully Digital Incubator. UNO THCO2 and Boldline incubation systems have several common features. They each are operated through a user-friendly touchscreen interface and offer chamber as well as sample feedback mode. They are compatible with Ocolab objective heaters. Boldline also monitors room temperature to quickly determine whether you're far from factory calibration temperature and need to recalibrate. Gas mixing is different. Uno THCO2 is more affordable and uses a manual gas mixer with floating ball flow meters with a 1% accuracy. Boldline Fully Digital uses a digital gas mixer with optical sensors with a 0.1% accuracy. The digital gas mixer is also operated through the touchscreen interface. Humidity for UNO THCO2 is achieved through an open-loop humidity module. After enabling it, you have to input room temperature, and the system will optimize parameters to reach approximately 85% humidity. Boldline Fully Digital has a sensor and feedback. Simply input the percentage of humidity you want to deliver to the sample in the range 51 to 95% using the touchscreen interface. UNO THCO2 has onboard memory. The Boldline touchscreen OcoTouch is currently being redesigned to include such feature. Boldline can be remotely operated using the optional smart box. Both UNO THCO2 and Boldline are compatible with third-party software. Select the stage top incubator based on your budget and application. If you need to associate all the environmental parameters with your images, we recommend using Boldline Fully Digital. The Fully Digital system will allow you to record not only temperature, but also gas concentration and percentage of humidity. 
Thank you for your time. If you have any questions, contact us at info at oco-lab.com.